Okay, long students, welcome one more time. Let's get started with this a second semester with the unit number three. Okay, now let's go for the objectives and then let's go for the activities. For example, in activity number one, you are going to identify different kind of books according to the category. In number two, you are going to use different expressions in order to give your opinion, right? If you are agree, if you don't agree about something, that is very important. So in activity number three, you are going to give one more time your opinion, but in this case, according to the elements that you have got there. For example, song, movie, or TV program. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. Let's get started with the topic. We have books, books, books. I don't know if you uh, used to go, for example, to the bookstore. In the bookstore, we have a lot of different options to take. For example, you can go and buy books, not books. However, you can uh, read there a certain words from different authors. In this case, so that we have got here different books and these books don't have, for example, the categories mentioned. For example, we are going to listen the word and you are going to practice the pronunciation of the names of these books. Are you ready? Okay, listen please and practice the pronunciation. Romance Romance Comedy Comedy Biography Biography Mystery Mystery Fairy tale Fairy tale Horror Horror Science fiction Science fiction Comic, comic, fable, fable, myth, myth. Once you learn the names of the books, now let's go for this activity. Complete the literary genres and match them with their definition. For example, we have in number one, so we have an incomplete genre and that you are going to think about in the next column that we have the names of certain books and giving us an idea what is that for example in number one what is your opinion yeah that's right romance now let's find the title of the book good so that we have i love story yeah it's very simple. Now, let's go for the rest of the genres and try to look for the title of the book, right? Let's go. In activity number two, we have listen and complete the dialogue. Before listening to it, so let's uh, learn the expressions about agreement and disagreement. Okay, let's go. Listen and repeat. I don't think so. I don't think so. I disagree. I disagree. I agree. I agree. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think. I think you're right. You're right. Good. Very good. That was very, very easy, right? Now, let's listen together and complete this conversation. Track 19. I think Nightmare House is great. I agree. I really like it. I disagree. I think it's boring. In activity number three, we have write what you like and what you don't like, but that is according that you want to give your opinion in a positive or in a negative connotation. We have three categories, song, movie, TV program. So pay attention, for example, the thumbs up and you are going to think about in the suitable expression that you have just learned before and that you are going to write down there, right? And you are going to write here the names 
okay, according to the category. For example, we have song. What is your favorite song? So that you are going to write down here the name of the song. Or, for example, if you don't like a song, you are going to write down the name of that. And the same way for movie and the same way for TV program. Okay? That's it that you are going to do. Don't forget to stick on the stickers here. Find them at the back to your book. That's all for this lesson. Thank you very much and thanks for watching. Bye.